another day. Another content creator lost to Twitch. So, let's get into early news. Alright guys, so if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe and become an Arlen Hater. But let's not even get into that yet. Before I get into the gameplay and my commentary, let's give you the facts. IRL streamer Bees on My Head TV found this out the hard way during his live stream on September 14th after he was suddenly shot at and carjacked. Twitch suspended his account for the behavior caught on camera and since informed the streamer that he won't be getting it back anytime soon. Think about that for a minute. Hey, sh <laughs> Alright, so we've got a look. This week for Twitch has been crazy. They've been going through it. They've been, I don't know what the hell's going on with them. What's going on, dude? This guy. Was, he was a victim of a crime and literally got banned. Had his livelihood just taken from him. Just taken just because of a, like he was probably filming and then see that coming and it happened. What if him filming that was his way of getting the law enforcement to see what was going on? And that could have Made the guy who committed the crime against him get caught. There's a reason why you have cameras, dude. But Twitch is like, oh yeah, let's, let's ban them. Oh, 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 fucking clowns, dude. Twitch, you're a, bunch, you're a bunch of clowns. Why am I even. I don't care if y'all take away my affiliation. My affiliate, whatever. I'm a Twitch affiliate, okay? I've got a couple of donations on Streamlabs from Stream. I've got most of my donations here on YouTube. I rely more on my YouTube income than my Twitch income um, and donations and stuff. Because, like, it's, I feel like on Twitch, it is easier to get donations, but I don't know. It's just, I don't like Twitch as much, especially now. And it makes me want to just stay on YouTube where I was getting more donations and more support while streaming anyway. Well, I take that back. I've had some pretty big streams on Twitch. Anyways, my opinion is, man, it's it's just like Twitch is getting crazy. So, let's get into the facts of what's been going on on Twitch for the past couple months. I made a video on Qualcomm. She was recently banned uh, for sexually suggestive content because she was dressed in a fucking Chun Li outfit, which is insane. <laughs> but hey, some people argue her leg was showing, and I guess that there's that. Okay, but let's talk about Alinity. We're gonna go, we're gonna dig deep into Twitch. So let's roll over to the gameplay on PS4. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get into it. Now, let's talk about Alinity. Alinity, Alinity. Let's go through the history of some egregious actions she has done and has not suffered consequences. Now, I'm all so for Chun-Li accepting consequences if her peers do too. But how are her peers going to get special treatment? That's right not in. fair, okay? So... Alinity. Something about a husband, she had got with him and then broke up with him just so she can become a U.S. citizen or Canadian citizen. Whatever she did, I don't know. That's another MJ, thing. That's her I'm first. I'm at the fourth thing. place on your list. Second. They're not even trying to pretend okay. they're legit. It's just sad when criminals don't take pride in their work well, anymore. I forget. So she, oh I'll yeah, she copy strike PewDiePie, taking Ooh, money no. from by copyright people. Okay, copyright striking people, false copyright claims. Nothing happened. Probably still has a YouTube channel. Nothing happened, because guess what? She's a pretty girl with some money. Right? 
Is that how we go? That's how I gotta put it. Or is she fucking him? It's one or the other. I, I don't. I have no feels. She fucking him. She fucking him. Or she. I don't know what she doing. I don't know what she doing. But it's gotta be something like that, right? She's getting some type of special treatment for whatever reason. Now, let's get into her third thing. So, the whole cat thing, whatever. Now, I know I'm missing one. There's another thing she did where she apparently was selling her panties online to, like, oh, no. I don't know. Dude, she's weird. Oh, Alinity's weird. Nice so. She's always been a weirdo. And she just looks good. But she's still a weirdo. I mean, I wouldn't even say she's attractive to me, necessarily. Anyone who does that loses all the attraction points. But... Let's get into some other streamers. Now, there's always been other streamers who've gotten away with stuff too. You can arguably say Ninja has gotten away with some pretty egregious actions themselves. I like Ninja. I'm actually a fan of Ninja. But we can't deny the fact that he's gotten special treatment. Twitch is promoting him on other Twitch streamers' channels. Twitch has also, to be honest, I didn't know they started has allowed him to to get people banned because he believed they were stream sniping him in the game, which has came out to in some ways has not been true. Yes, he has apologized for those actions, but I'm just saying he didn't suffer really any consequences because, because he was a money maker for Twitch. These are all facts, but no one wants to. You know, people tend to have some type of connection with people who are celebrities and believe they can do no wrong. I'm not the same way. I think everyone should get equal treatment, especially on a platform that wants to be seen as consistent. YouTube is struggling with the same thing. We, we don't need another platform. Really, in my opinion, Twitch is making worse mistakes than YouTube is. In my opinion. In YouTube, YouTube's mistakes are pretty fucked up. These mistakes that Twitch is doing, they are, they are platform killing, okay? Now, sorry guys, I'm a little distracted by the game, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty fun. Let's get into why I think Quaco should have gotten a slap on the hand, not not to do it again. It's because our peers have. And arguably, yes, they are bigger. Why didn't they get a bigger slap on the hand? I think the bigger one should always get the biggest slap on the hand. Look, think about it like this. If you a big brother or a big sister, who getting the biggest who getting the biggest punishment? Let's say you and your little brother did something. You and your little sibling, your younger sibling did something together. Who you think getting most of the punishment? The the oldest one. Because they are seen as the ones that know better. So why didn't Ninja and Alenity get Huge punishments for things they have done in the past. MJ, and then Quaco, quiet here now. she's a smaller creator. She's not as away, established. Did what they did was horrible. Why didn't she get a second chance? Not. What if she doesn't know all the policies? I'm not saying she doesn't. But I'm just saying. How can you give Alinity and Ninja just a slap on the hand and not give people who have not had that many controversial? Um, incidents. She's only had one instance for, for what I've seen. This is the only time she's done something stupid. Okay? Why is Quaco going through that? Now, after that, now that, that's just my opinion on Quaco. I don't care if you guys don't like it, you can dislike the fucking video. I don't care. I'm not losing my integrity because you guys want to look good. That ain't how I'm rough. Okay? I'm real. Now, Captain, let's talk about guys look like they all the, the situation. So they can occupy it themselves. With, uh, locked up the ones who objected. B. Okay. With, uh, that I forget his name, Base B's TV. Whatever his name is. Let's talk about him. With the police. Oh my gosh, I'm trying not to die. Okay, let me look here. I need to see his name. So, B's on my head TV, right? B's on my head TV was carjacked in the middle of streaming. Someone shot at him and he was streaming, okay? And he got carjacked. 
Now think about this for a minute. You're like, oh, Twitch will probably uh, support him. I think even YouTube would support him. If it was on a stream and that happened to somebody, I've never heard of YouTube banning somebody. Twitch literally banned somebody because they were in damn danger. Now, if that ain't if that ain't fucked up, I don't, I really don't know what is. Think about this for a minute. You got banned not because of something you did insane on camera. I don't know him as a content. He may have done some stuff in the past. That doesn't matter though. This guy literally got banned because he was in danger. And they said he has no chance of coming back. What kind of shit is that? Dude, if that's the type of platform that I'm streaming on, I don't know if I want to stream on it. Like I said, I'm Twitch affiliate, and I've loved the experience of growth and excitement on Twitch. I'm not gonna lie, it's a great platform. But the people running it need to be assessed. This is not right. And if they don't fix their problems, I'm afraid Twitch isn't gonna last too much longer. How much time do they really have? They need Jesus or something, man. It's not gonna work. They gotta stop it. Even YouTube isn't this crazy. You, I feel like, dude, on Twitch, I sneeze, I get banned. That's how I feel. I sneeze, I get banned. I shouldn't feel like that. I shouldn't feel like my income is going to be in shambles, and that's going to make a lot of people not want to be on Twitch because they know their income could disappear. Matter. Just one wrong move. And then, wait a minute. You gave Dr. Disrespect his Twitch channel back? Even after what he did? What did he do? I forget. Some he was in a bathroom field. Okay. I feel like that should be punished. But you gave him a shadow back. And then this guy actually was a victim of a crime? And you're not even talking about giving him his channel back? You gotta be, you gotta be kidding me. Twitch. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, that's way too many. Anyways, guys, tell me your opinions down below. Do you think that this guy should get his Twitch shadow back? Maybe you guys are like, oh, screw that, he doesn't deserve his stuff back. I think he does. I think he deserves his whole Twitch shadow back. And I think he deserves support from the community. And if they, if Twitch is not going to give it to him, dude, if you see this video, go make a Twitch, make a channel here on YouTube. Grow here. Because as far as I'm concerned, it's safe. It, it's like way more stable. Yes, streaming is more likely to be successful on Twitch or so on YouTube. But there's successful streamers here. You got, uh, well, no, Nick A30, he went to fucking Twitch. What a dumbass. Uh, you got Mixer too. I mean, Mixer is good. Mixer's not gonna do that shit to you, I doubt it. So. There you go. Oh, let me take his weapon. Bam! You guys ah. there Give me your shit. Right? Oh! That was an epic punch. I do all these epic finishes on here. My combos are like, oh, dude. Not hit me. I'm trying to keep my shit. Not to have anywhere to stay. It's a good thing these sable agents have body armor, cause I just might lose my temper. The finishers are insane. Oh! Oh! Come here! I'm pretty good at this game, am I? But anyways, guys. Just enjoy the rest of this gameplay if you like to. I'm just gonna finish playing this gameplay. Wait a minute! Ah! Let's stay alive! Oh gosh, dude. Stay on guard. You can't web these guys. You, can't web. you gotta try to keep my streak though for sure. Okay, I There's no guy. I can't use them on there. Watch my back! 
Yep, you can't use them. Bam! I love doing those uh, finishers. They're just so satisfying. Ooh! Epic air finisher. I'm trying to get to a streak of 200 again. It's possible. Oh, that's a missile. You guys aren't very private. Bam! Bam! That kick was epic. Oh, we're gonna get to the streak, guys. I think we're gonna do it. Ooh. Oh, he tried me. Dude, that swing kick is epic. Oh, he hit me so hard. He, he actually knocked my streak down. Finish the sable. That was harder than it should have been. It was harder. It shouldn't have been as hard as it was. Thanks, Spider Man. Captain. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed that video. Up back Thank you home. so much for watching. Good. Make sure you and subscribe for more um, early news, I guess. And so they won't be pulling that